Hi there, I'm Randy from Madrona Labs and I'm going to make a short video today to do some performance measurements of Kaivo. Um, I've just released Apple Silicon native versions of all the Madrona Labs plugins. That's Alto, Kaivo, and Verta. Um, Alto Verb, the effect is also out there, but that was already native to begin with. Um, so I've got my M1 MacBook Air here, which is I think a great machine for doing audio stuff uh, in general. And I'm going to see how many voices of Kaivo I can make before it becomes unusable uh, and then compare that to the native version later. So uh, I can pull up live here and make an instance of Kaivo. Then I'm going to go to the Peaking Lights patch in the machines directory and turn up the number of voices to eight. So this is doing some granular synthesis and some physical modeling. It's pretty heavy on the CPU. Now I'm going to copy the whole track as many times as I can uh, until things start glitching. So one, two Kaivos, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. And that's the one that starts glitching. This is pretty repeatable, which is good for doing a comparison. Um, so we have 12 Kaivos running successfully without glitches. And if we look at the Apple Activity Monitor, we can see that this process, AU Hosting Compatibility Service, is taking up most of the computer's CPU, about 325%. Now, how can we have 325% of CPU? You may know this, but it, it does a rough estimate of what one core is. And that actually gets a little complicated on these new ARM machines because we have the efficiency cores and the performance cores down below. So what is 100% of what? Uh, there's a blog post I found that's really good from eclecticlight.co. And uh, this person dives into what CPU percentage actually means on the M1 Max. If you're interested, there's a deep dive for you. Uh, so anyway, back to Kaivo, I've got all these running. I'm now going to install the Apple Silicon version and see what the numbers look like there. Maybe get a fresh cup of coffee. Hi there. So I've got the new Apple Silicon version of Kaivo installed and I've added one instance of it to live and it's running that peaking lights patch cranked up to eight voices. So now I'm gonna see how many Kaivos can I add before I start getting glitches again? Okay, it looks like 17 was the one that caused ongoing glitches and 16 is fine. So where we had 12 copies in emulation, we have 16 now running natively. You might be thinking, that's only a 33% difference and I expected the new hotness to be a lot hotter. Well, I think that just speaks to the really great success that Apple had with their emulator software. Uh, the Rosetta 2 emulator was able to run DSP code uh, for the Intel machines uh, really quickly on the new ARMs. Um, so it was a fine thing to use for a while, but 33% more is, is pretty great too. And so I'm happy to release this update and I'm happy to move on to other things now. I uh, hope you enjoy it. 